What's up? Alright guys, I'm back, and I'm going to make a another natural. I'm going to do a rough, a rough outline of this one. And <clears throat> I'm going to try to do it quick. Sun's setting, it's getting a little bit later. Open my garage all the way, let as much light in as possible. Of course I dropped this pen. So, you guys are going to have the privilege to watch me do this. Need the angle grinder. So after it is nice and rasped and rounded, it looks awesome. Nice and even, both sides. The fork was really well split in there. So all I did was take um, super glue, pour the super glue in the cracks, wait until it filled up because it does, the wood does soak up quite a bit of the super glue. And then sprinkle in some sawdust. And this also had aluminum dust in it as well from when I was sanding some of my descenders the other day. So it turned out like kind of gray. But hopefully it'll kind of be like uh, sparkly a little bit. Bring the funk back. Okay, so it's nice and smoothed over. Really no rough spots left. The file goes quick. The filing part goes quick. And then I'm just gonna go with some sandpaper. <laughs> Alright, so once you got to sand it up to an appreciable finish, you can put whatever, on a natural uh, slingshot, you can put whatever kind of finish you want on it, really. Um, mostly what I do is I put two-part epoxy resin on mine, because it creates a super strong, watertight, super shiny finish, and I love it. But what I've been doing lately with some of my naturals is actually putting a 
satin uh, finish on uh, with spray polyurethane. And what I want to do first before I put the polyurethane on is I'm going to put on some boiled linseed oil. So I'll go ahead and show you here. Let's tilt you. You can see the contrast between the oiled side and the non-oiled side. Holy moly, does that look good. You can see how the oil really, really brings out the greens. And actually, <clears throat> it looks still shiny, and it is pretty shiny right now because it's still a little oily. But it's really, really drinking up this oil. So... I am going to let it soak for a bit inside of a plastic bag. So I had to bring it outside to kind of show the grains in it and stuff and uh, how good the oiling does because the natural light just makes it look awesome. But look at those insane grains in there. Yeah, I think it looks awesome.